powerful earthquake shakes Morocco, killing more than 2,000. The quake, centered in the mountains just outside of Marrakech, was the strongest to hit that area in a century. It didn't last long, but felt like years. A powerful earthquake struck Morocco on Friday night, killing more than 2,000 people and setting off frantic rescue efforts through rubble-strewn city streets and remote rural areas as some residents sifted through mountains of debris with their bare hands. The earthquake, which had a magnitude of at least 6.8 and was centered about 50 miles from the southern city of Marrakech, was the strongest to hit the area in a century. It rippled through the center of the country, shaking not only Marrakech but also Agadir, a resort on Morocco's Atlantic coast, and Ouarzazate, a major city in the southeast. Much of the affected zone is rural, with many houses made from mud bricks, a traditional construction method that is highly vulnerable to earthquakes and heavy rains. Scenes of devastation were unfolding across the country. In Marrakech, the main city of southern Morocco, residents poured out of their homes onto the city's cobblestone streets to find piles of rubble from buildings that had crumbled around them, including mounds of red dust from the walled old city or Medina. In the hardest-hit rural areas, Moroccans climbed through the canyons between collapsed homes that cascaded across roads and towns and tried to retrieve their dead. About 30 miles southwest of Marrakech, in the town of Amismas near the epicenter, Yasmina Benani was about to go to sleep on Friday night when she heard a loud noise. The shaking cracked walls, broke faces and lamps, and sent chunks of ceiling falling to the floor, clogging her kitchen sink and stove with dust and debris. At least 2,012 people were killed in the quake, and at least 2,059 were injured. The precise size of the quake was not yet clear. Estimated its magnitude at 6.8, but the Moroccan Geological Institute put it at 7.2. <laughs> That would make it more than twice as large, according to the logarithmic scale on which earthquakes are measured. The U.S. agency said local estimates can often be more accurate, but initial readings of magnitude are measured automatically and need to be reviewed by seismologists. The contours of the damage were also still taking shape on Saturday, but it was clear that the scope of the catastrophe was extensive, with the rural provinces outside of Marrakech the hardest hit. According to early breakdowns of casualties by provinces, the death toll was especially heavy in the rural house region southeast of Marrakech, which includes parts of the high Atlas Mountains.
كرونت صافي كوسنت روح انت كال هاك انت تيحو لنا تنغي تيحو لنا صافي كلشي غانيكم في السليع ولا كلشي ولا القهوي تيجمين وكوزول تكوز دار ابراهيم كوسو The United Nations Office for the Coordination of Humanitarian Affairs said in a statement that more than 300,000 civilians in Marrakesh and its outskirts have been affected by the earthquake. Moroccan architects say the area near the epicenter has many earthen houses that are not built to withstand an earthquake of this strength. Omar Farkani, the former president of the Moroccan National Order of Architects, said that in such areas, the residents are often too poor to pay architects and end up building their houses themselves or with the help of low-skilled workers. Despite the government's efforts to impose better earthquake-resistant building standards in recent years, the architect said, Many builders still flout the regulations to cut construction costs. The early rescue efforts in some of these hard-hit rural areas were proving to be challenging, in part because many of the villages are built into the red craggy mountains around Marrakesh, but also because the few roads snaking through the countryside were blocked by fallen debris. Phone service and electricity were also out in some of the most affected areas. The worst in Morocco's recent history was a 5.8 magnitude earthquake that killed at least 12,000 people in March 1960. Hagadir crumbled under that quake's force. About a third of its population perished. Restaurants, shops, and the central market were leveled, and thousands of people were buried under concrete. <laughs> الرحمة والغفران بالنسبة لباقي الحيوانات ديال الناس باقي محاصرة في أسفال ديال الأنقاض